Be sure and put on there if they're an employee, if they need to go to dialysis, if they, right. if they're, if, what Here type of emergency it is. The calls are coming in fast. People are stranded, worried about their loved ones, and at least 30 dialysis patients desperately need transport. We are uh, attempting to get any uh, people that own four-wheel drives to give us a call so we can dispatch them to help transport people needing uh, uh, transport to hospitals, uh, nurses, shift changes for the hospital, dialysis patients, and things of this nature. Volunteers appear out of nowhere. Meanwhile, power flickers off and on, and the police communication center is without computers for over an hour. Amid the confusion, emergency management officials plan for the night ahead. The streets are going to be slick with all of the snow on it, and when that freeze hits, there's going to be a sheet of ice on it. Meanwhile, Public Works is busy trying to keep ice from forming on the bridges. But we're using a, a mixture of salt and gravel and, and uh, sand, the same mixture that the state uses, and it's really doing good. All over the county, falling trees and branches knock down power lines. Some of the wires are live, and utility workers warn residents to stay clear, even if you're sure the wires are grounded. They stopped the traffic from coming both ways because they said the wires were live, and we were standing over there, and they told us to move because if one of the wires came down all over us, there was nothing they could do about it. The power companies are working as fast as they can to repair the lines, but they know the mercury is falling fast, icing up trees and bringing more branches crashing onto the wires. Elizabeth Gilliam, Channel 13 Eyewitness News.